ladies and gentlemen, in a in one of the toughest jobs in the caper, the Prime Minister and the Premier of Victoria are number two and three as far as profile and what people really care about. And number one is being the CEO of the AFL. And Gil McLaughlin is with us this morning. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, uh, can I just say, I thought the, uh, the McLaughlin brothers, we just had uh, uh, Jesse and uh, Ella Hooper there, uh, the Hooper family, I thought the McLaughlin family did a fantastic job on Monday night. Do we all think the yeah, Brownlow yeah, was absolutely, great? absolutely, yeah. But, uh, Hamish did a great job emceeing. You called him beautifully, mate. Uh, congratulations. It was a really good Brownlow medal. Thanks, Ed. Yeah, I, I thought, I thought Hamish went well. He was bloody nervous. Um, but we took about an hour out of it, which I think people are feedback got it was shorter and punchier. Yeah. People enjoyed it more. So... <laughs> Um, I, we, that took some, some work with Channel 7, but uh, it rated really well. And, and I think part of that, it was just shorter and punchier and uh, people seemed to like it. It was. And I've got to say, Gil, uh, the highlight of my night was the disappointment in your voice when you read E. Kerno, three votes. <laughs> um, <laughs> we were working hard to make it interesting. <laughs> and uh, I didn't expect it to be all done by around 21, I must say. So it was a sort of labouring to get there and then punched it out at the end. Hey, Gil, the fairy tale grand final would have been Collingwood and Richmond from an AFL point of view and the uh, Melbourne crowd. But to have for the Giants, eight years in, you know, their membership base is strong. They've got great corporate support. It was a big investment from the AFL. You must, at one level as a CEO, be pretty proud of the fact that club is going as well as you could hope for eight years in. Yeah, it is, does. And I, I do think this year it feels like year eight and the injuries they've had, they've lost players, they've scrapped. They've, you know, they've got some, some journey in blue collar players in there and I reckon people feel they've earned it. Mm. They've come from wherever they were this year. I'm, I'm not looking at Ed. No, they're, 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 they're down to the last 40 first round yeah. picks, I must admit. <laughs> <laughs> I think they've had a, they, this year to get there in the, the final series they've had. I think they've won four of the last six games by four points, three points, two points, one point. So they've scrapped there and, no, and now right. it's a big Sydney story. There's, there's nine pages in the Telegraph in Sydney today so it's sort of a I think it's a good, good for the national comp and uh, you know, they, I think they've deserved to get there this year. Good on you, mate. And uh, they've got great support from the AFL. You've got your son over here. What's your son's yeah. name? Sydney. <laughs> yeah. I walked into that, didn't yeah. I? <laughs> well, seeing your other kids are called Greater and Western. <laughs> How long, how long did you blokes work on that one? <laughs> Mate, uh, the highlight of the week for you, uh, yet to come, of course, the grand final. Um, you've got the entertainment right this year on behalf of Triple M. Uh, they're all tri Triple M uh, uh, on our playlist. Fantastic. I, I think you've got the balance nice uh, with uh, something for the young kids, uh, some contemporary You're music. You're a big Tones and I fan, Ed. Tones and I. He's been dancing along to Dance Monkey all week. That's yeah, cool. That's yeah. It, uh, Ed's a big music connoisseur generally. I, uh, I've seen your playlist, Ed. It's uh, nothing nothing past the it's 80s. About Doobie <laughs> Brothers, that's where you stopped, I think. Uh, <laughs> yeah. That was the end of you. Uh, yeah, but it is. I think you've done really well. Uh, and it promises to be, and I think it's going to be 16 degrees and... Uh, but it's going to be dry. Condition. It's going to yeah. be pretty good. It sets itself up for a beauty, doesn't it? I think so. I think they. Uh, everyone looks at the contest and go, they're actually evenly matched, and it's going to be a, a tough game, open. Um, there's good forwards in both teams. There's good backs in both teams, and obviously strong midfield. So I actually do feel people looking and going, this is going to be a cracking game, and yep. there'll be a lot of Richmond people there. There's going to be a good, strong contingent of GWS, and I reckon it's, it's a really good grand final. And good news, uh, Gil, the arc's going uh, beautifully. Uh, no problem. <laughs> No, no teething problems at all there. You want to put your hand up to operate it? I'd like to sit in there. I'd like to... Uh, so I, actually, I, no, that's the worst. I said to Jared Waitley, I said, Jared, well, the, the, the version next year has all the tech, but you're operating. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's a whole new dimension to it. Hey, uh, you've thrown an idea up, I believe, I uh, haven't heard it come out of your mouth, around potentially the players getting a review. Are you, are you serious about that? No, well, it's an, it's an idea, and it's just obviously of seeded. I mean, the three things are the tech and where you keep investing, because it was... There was four slow-mo replay cameras uh, we'd invested on the, that day and not one of them got that one. Yeah. Or they had to use the same vision that the, the TV had. Then there's improving the process and obviously continuing to invest in the best people and, and schooling them up. But in the process, you know, they're reviewing everyone at the time. But if you actually put some responsibility back to the clubs to say, OK, this one's touched, and you just got, had, say, two reviews, and then actually you can look at every angle and, and, and knowing they only had two, I, I do think a bit of... Bit of theatre, Sh isn't that? Sharing yeah. the responsibility. I yeah, just look at cricket yeah. and go, well, 
actually knowing how difficult it is and the pressure, if you actually push some responsibility back on... Anyway, it's an idea... That I reckon we should go the whole way, go back to the, when the captains were the umpires as well. Why don't we go the whole way and have responsibility? That'd be fantastic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, I, saw, I saw Tommy Brown and he goes, that idea will never work. And I explained to him, he goes, no, it's perfect, it's really good. <laughs> <laughs> hey, uh, the, uh, I know you, you are working on the ARC and this is only just the, uh, the first uh, incarnation of it, uh, but uh, t tell me about... Uh, how that would work? Are we just better off saying, why don't we get rid of touched? Why don't we just say, if it's touched, I mean, I'll, I'll put this to you because we did a tr straw poll and it wasn't that well received, I must admit. But <laughs> why should somebody who fails in smothering properly be rewarded as opposed to the person who kicks it 40 metres and it goes through for a goal? Why don't we just take the headache out? Have, hang on. You don't get a say, so shut up. <laughs> and neither does Gil, by the way. Yeah. Just yeah. in case you're interested. Yeah. It's all if for it, democracy as long yeah. as it supports yeah. his idea. It is. Yeah. A de democratic dictatorship is a wonderful way to go. Now, if you punch it through, point. But if somebody half gets a fingernail on it and it doesn't deviate and it goes through, why wouldn't we just say, goal? Well, because it's touched. No, fair yeah. enough. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, Gil... <laughs> You should have some sort of committee where people like Ed can get together and discuss <laughs> these sort of suggestions. Yeah, Ed goes to the competition committee and they have him handcuffed to a bench. He gets three <laughs> things to say and that's it. <laughs> now, Ed Gil, you get accused of a lot of things. Apparently, the GWS thought there was a conspiracy theory that you'd rub Toby Green out and then there's another that was, theory. That, that was the, after the conspiracy the week before we let him off. Yes, yeah, that's yeah. right. And apparently, you're going to sack the GWS coach and now he's coach of the year. Talk, talk us through. And Toby Green, an instant like that, that comes up, you know your phone's going to... Uh, ring off the uh, off the dial. What do you what do you think of Toby Green going into a grand final? Um, what do you think? Of, of, of uh, him as a the player players? and the intrigue of someone like that is it? Uh, I, I it's great he, theatre. He, he's a star player yeah. and he's going to be a huge story for the grand final. Um, with respect to the week before, it sounds a bit you know a bit uh, uh, sort of boring. But you know, you trust the people. Michael Christian. I've never Michael Christian makes a decision. And he's got people around him. Then, if they, people don't agree with it, there's an independent tribunal. And if people don't agree with that, they go to a, a, an appeal court. Yeah. I can't, he's trust the system. And people have their different views. And Neil Mitchell was having a go about this. And they said, well, Neil, what do you think? He goes, well, I think he should have got two weeks. It's, it, then that's opinion. If you, if you trust the process, you leave it to that. And he's available this week. He's going to make a huge impact because he's a star. And, uh, and <laughs> yeah, there's going to be a lot of theatre and a lot of people looking at him this week. And uh, um, I'm, well, sure, I'm, sure, I'm sure at some point he's going to be near... Dusty Martin, it'll be a great Yeah, one a lot of one. people looking with one eye, too. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just surprised to hear that Neil Mitchell was grumpy about something. <laughs> I'm just trying to give you a half volley. <laughs> uh, grand final parade tomorrow, just in wrapping up. It's a, it's a huge day. It, it's gone from 1977, where it used to finish up in the Burke Street Mall. That was the first one in the first televised grand final. A draw, of course, back, at, uh, back in 1977, as I mentioned, the first one I ever went to as a kid. Um, to now, I think you've got this one right too, and there's a lot of criticism about this early on, going down to the MCG, but the whole precinct around the MCG gives so many people the opportunity. And I think for kids, you're not always going to get grand final tickets, especially when the big clubs are in, in action and you've got the members and all that type of stuff. It's a really good opportunity on a public holiday to get a feel for footy and see the stars, isn't it? Yeah, on well, school holidays, so there's, it was... Thousands of kids there yesterday, will be today, and then tomorrow there'll be, I don't know, it might be a quarter of a million people there, and it's yeah. a huge precinct. Get down there, it's, everything's free, and um, you know, obviously the Tigers and the Giants will be there, and it's, and, you know, it's not the grand final, but it's a great day, that parade and all the players there, and um, yeah, it's a big part of the week, and a, and a big thing for Melbourne, I reckon, and it's, a, it's um, got great support from the government, and it's a, it's a big, big precinct this year. Yeah, it is indeed. Go on, go on. well done. And... Uh, I'm led to believe there's a few of the big, uh, big media companies, big overseas ones, all sniffing around at the moment, and they're just seeing what's going on in AFL football, and they've suddenly caught on. Hang on, this is something that's pretty special, and it's uh, yeah, it really. So we're talking so Google and Facebook and, and YouTube all things, and all yeah, the uh, yeah, Amazon, yeah. the big players. All those big ones, does yeah. They'd be whining and dining uh, the CEO of the AFL. Well, I think they should be. That's for sure. But uh, but more importantly, for the clubs and everybody else, it's uh, you know we know that these new streaming services are, are huge, and I think it's wonderful that. There's a worry in these situations that domestic games like ours can sometimes get swallowed up by international sports. And, and I say this sincerely to you, Gil, and your team at the AFL, in that you have kept pushing, kept pushing, kept getting the game better, changing things, sometimes to our chagrin, but others internationally are looking at it. And when they turn up, as they have the last month, and look at the figures, and you see 
last week 90 something thousand for Richmond and, uh, and Geelong and 86,000 for Collingwood and GWS and explain well this is a fledgling team that doesn't have much supporters and they say you mean the two biggest crowds in the world last weekend all happened over a period of 18 hours at the same ground in one city in Australia and they start to take notice of it and I just think the game congratulations to you oh, in real health at the moment thank you um, Listen, it's, it's, it's a supporter's game. I think people take for granted how passionate, how big our game is sometimes. When I said on Friday night when people were rolling, expecting it to be 90-odd thousand people, there's nothing else like that going on in the world, and it's because of people like this in the room who love yep. the game and go along. Um, you know, we, we're incredibly thankful and grateful the supporters we have, and as we said, we're trying to grow the game in Australia so there's more, more, more of them. So we're going OK, and, uh, yeah, there'll be a lot there tomorrow and be a lot watching, and it, it comes to a head. Good on you, mate. Uh, good luck for the weekend. Let's hope that the, there is no injuries nor the umpires playing any outcome in the result. Nor, the, nor the score review. Or the score review. <laughs> 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 the, the, the mighty arc. Yeah. Uh, and, uh, Gil, good luck for everything, mate. We're going to uh, come back and give away the last grand final ticket. Thanks, Gil. Right after this. Thanks to Lexus of Blackburn.